A European prince married a girl of African origin. What happened to them 23 years later? When Prince Maximilian of Liechtenstein married Angela Brown, a native of Panama, people were shocked. After all, this was the first time in history that a member of the reigning European family married a girl of African origin. How did the couple fight for love, and how did their life turn out after 23 years? When the American actress of African descent, Meghan Markle, became the wife of Prince Harry, for many, it was like a fairy tale about Cinderella. This story proved that every ordinary girl of any origin can become a princess. However, in the history of the European monarchy, there was already a similar example, when in 2000, Prince Maximilian of Liechtenstein married a girl of African descent. At that time, the couple had to go through great trials to be together. After all, society then was not yet ready for such alliances. In addition, from time immemorial, it has been customary for princes to marry only girls of nobility. However, the Liechtenstein royal family showed everyone that the world is changing, and in the new century, it is time to abandon past prejudices. Angela Gisela Brown was born into an ordinary family in Panama, in 1958. Her father was a businessman, and her mother was a housewife. When she was five years old, the family moved to New York City. There, Angela graduated from elementary and high school and then entered the Parsons School of Design. In some surprising way, the girl had a rare, refined taste and good manners like royalty. Angela wanted to achieve success on her own, without any help. Therefore, soon after graduation, she partnered with a firm in Hong Kong to establish her very own fashion label called A. Brown. Then she worked as a fashion director at the clothing firm Adrienne Vitardini. When Angela was 39, her life changed completely. At one of the parties in New York, she met the Prince of Liechtenstein, Maximilian, who was 11 years younger than her. The couple had a big age difference which society also did not approve of in those days. The Prince of Liechtenstein is the world's sixth wealthiest monarch, his fortune is around $3.5 billion. The combined wealth of the members of the House of Liechtenstein reportedly exceeds the wealth of the British royal family. As you can see, being in such a wealthy family is a great privilege. Prince Maximilian never planned to ascend the throne of his father. Maximilian graduated from the European Business School and has been in business all his life. Royal duties and ceremonies almost never interested him. He kept a low profile and tried not to show off his personal life. He fell in love with Angela Brown, who impressed him with her great taste and style. However, before proposing to her, he received the approval of his father, Prince Hans Adam II. Of course, many people in Liechtenstein were shocked by the choice of the prince. Some were sure that the monarchy in this state was at the end of an era. But there were also people of more progressive views who were not embarrassed by either the age or the origin of the bride. Today it is hard to imagine how difficult it was for the couple to go against public opinion because this was the first interracial marriage in the history of the European royal court. Prince Maximilian, and Angela Brown overcame all prejudice and tied the knot in New York City in January 2000. In total, there were approximately 500 guests at the wedding, including all family members. The bride even wore a dress of her own design. It was an elegant outfit with long sleeves and minimalist jewelry. She also wore a royal tiara on her head. It is interesting to note that Meghan Markle's attire during the wedding ceremony was very similar to the dress of Angela Brown. After the wedding, Angela became a Princess of Liechtenstein and Countess of Rietbeck. A year later, their son Alfonso was born. Since then, the family has lived happily together. They often visit Liechtenstein, Panama, the UK and the USA. However, they stay away from the press and do not attend royal social events. 
Perhaps the only event they attended together was the wedding of Countess Elizabeth in Belgium in 2006. Princess Angela gave her only interview in 2015 about tourism in Panama. The rest of the time, the couple refused to communicate with the press. They also tried to hide their son from journalists. However, several pictures with the boy got on the internet. Today Alfonso is already 21 years old. He is sixth in line to the royal throne of Liechtenstein. But he is unlikely to take the throne, so he does not take part in royal ceremonies and lives like an ordinary guy of his age. Prince Maximilian, and Princess Angela have been married for 23 years. This proves that the strongest couples can be those who marry for love. And it doesn't matter what their age difference and origin is. The story of this couple showed everyone that the world in the new century should be ruled by love, not social origin. Also, old dynasties are adapting to life in today's globalized world, and old customs are becoming a thing of the past.